Hey guys, what's up Scorpio? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So flip it, I need to. The four of Cups flips. Could be done with a Cancer. Could be something that you're no longer entertaining. We'll see. Alright, so remember it's a general reading. Just take what yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Uh, for some, you could be moving. Moving into a new house. All right, immediate future, what's coming up for Scorpio, please? The King of Cups, that's your energy. You also could be dealing with another water sign. You got the world there, Capricorn energy, and the Nine of Cups. Looks like something's changing. It feels like it's changing for the bet. Uh, I don't want to say the better, but at the, the bottom, we got the Five of Pentacles and the Four of Cups. So somebody just kind of may have been silent or... Um, not acting towards something, not making much effort, much movement, but it looks like, um, for some, you also could have got, like, tired of the situation or kind of fed up with something. Show me that King of Cups, please, for Scorpio. And you got the Emperor Aries Energy. And the Knight of Cups, we got somebody approaching you. Yeah, wanting to take a chance. Fresh, this can be fresh starts. Just very optimistic, very loving, very sure energy. You have the Emperor there. So, this and the fact that you have the King and the Knight. I mean, you could have more than one person. Heck, it could be three, but it looks like, you know, at the very least, somebody is coming forward. Very lovingly, very hopeful, very full of optimism. Yeah, oh shoot, chariot, cancer, energy, the eight of wands, the wheel. This is a big change. There's some type of communication that's coming in here. And it's like it was a matter of time. For some, there could be travel or um, just forward movement. But there's a big change. And it, it's, it's already like destined. There's communication that's here. That's a nice reading. The Queen of Wands could be dealing with the fire sign. But it's more just like the confidence. This person is so attracted to you. They're coming straight towards you very lovingly. Very like affectionately. Show me this Nine of Cups, please, for the outcome for Scorpio. And you got the Two of Swords. The Star. Wow, Aquarius Energy. But you got both Wish cards there for the outcome. But, okay. So, with the, um, the Two of Swords and the Two of Pentacles, the seven of cups you have options there you have choices so it's kind of like it's feeling like the balls in your court type thing you have both wish cards here which is really cool energy but then we also have the two of swords the two of pentacles the seven of cups so you do have options here and you may kind of like um weigh your options or just give it some thought it doesn't feel like it's something that like yeah, <laughs> give it some thought. The hermit pops out. Um, introspection. You know, you may kind of just take a little bit of time to figure out what it is exactly that you want. All right, Scorpio, I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys would like to contact me for a personal reading, that information's below as well. You guys take care and I will see you next time.